In this video, you'll learn about the floor tab and table management using SeatMe. The floor tab allows you to view what's going on on the current day. When you navigate to floor, on the right side of the screen, you'll see tabs for reservations, waitlist, and servers. Under the reservations tab, you can filter your view between upcoming reservations, seated parties, and all, which includes the previous lists, as well as manager blocks, cancellations, and finished diners. First, we can tap an upcoming reservation to view and edit details. Then, when the party arrives and you are ready to seat them, simply press and drag their reservation to their assigned table. Once you release, you will see the seated icon. Next, you can tap once on the table to see the seated and upcoming reservations for that table. And a double tap will bring up a list of statuses so you can quickly update the status of this table. When a diner is finished and the table is clear, simply tap the gray check mark at the top of the status list to finish and clear the table. Next, we'll take a look at seating unnamed walk-in parties. In the bottom right corner of the screen, simply tap the size of the walk-in party that you wish to seat, and then tap the table you're seating them at. If a walk-in party requires more than one table, simply drag the additional tables on top of the seated party to combine them. If the shift notes icon is red in the bottom left, make sure to check for any notes assigned to this shift. SeatMe also comes preloaded with a few different timers. Under the timers tab at the top, you can overlay your tables with currently seated time, time remaining, next reservation, or next reservation time. To the right of the Reservations tab, you'll find the tab for Waitlist. To add a guest to the waitlist, tap Add Party. Enter the guest's name and phone number, number of guests, and give them a quote time. Once you're ready to page the guest, simply tap their name again on the list and tap the button for either your table is ready or see the host. This will then send the guest a text message. Once the guests arrive, simply drag their name to a table just as you did with a reservation to seat them. Finally, we'll go over how to assign servers to sections. First, click the Servers tab in the upper right corner. To add a server, click the Add Server button, enter a name, and choose a color. After you've added your servers, you can make them active by assigning them to tables. Tap the Assign Tables button, then tap the name of the first server that you would like to assign, and then simply tap the tables they will be serving. When you are finished, tap Done. Now you will see the server marked as active, and SeatMe will keep track of how many covers they are currently handling and how many total they've handled for the shift. When you are finished, simply click on the server's name and click Cut Server to remove them from their tables. For additional questions and support, please call us at 844-889-9066 or email us at support at seatme.com.